OK, so here's question 20. A group of students was asked to find how the velocity of a cylindrical battery changes as it rolls down an inclined board. The group marked the position of the battery on the board every second with an X. These markings were used to obtain the following results table, complete the table. So let's read the table. We've got time and we've got distance from the starting position. So if this was my starting position, my S equal to zero, then my it means this one here is 0 0.18. It means this one here is 0 0.84. It means this one here is um, 1.75. And it means this one here is 3.14. OK, so it's asking for the average velocity in the previous second. So um, in the previous second. So this is this is time equal zero. This one is time is equal to one. This one is time is equal to two. This one is time is equal to three. This one is time is equal to four. In the previous second, how far has it travelled? Average velocity in the previous second. So this distance here, this distance here is... 0 0.84 minus 0 0.18.84 minus 0.18 is 0 0.66 meters. So my average velocity is going to be 0 0.66 divided by 1, which of course is 0 0.66 meters per second. Now the average velocity from the start is going to be the distance traveled from the start which was 0 0.84. So here I'm going to do 0 0.84 divided by the time from the start, divided by 2. So 0 0.84 divided by 2, oops, 0 0.84 divided by 2 is 0 0.42 meters per second. Hello.